What's good everybody and welcome to Tropico 5. Uh, for those of you who are new, I'm Katmandu and in this video, yeah, I'm going to have a little look at Tropico 5. Um, this is going to be my first look. Uh, I've never played any Tropico games before, so this is brand new to me. Um, obviously, I recently brought, well, it was a few months ago now, I brought Tropico 6. And, um, and then around Christmas time, uh, I seen that Tropico 5 was uh, it was sort of being given away for free for uh, via Epic stores. So I thought, why not? I thought I'll pick it up and uh, I thought maybe I'll play this one first before number 6, just to get a bit of a feel of the game. Um, obviously this game come out, I think it was 2015, I think. Don't quote me on that, I could be wrong. I'm sure I read that it was 2015. Um, so yeah, it is quite an old game now, but you know what we like to do on the channel. I, I normally rotate about six games uh, And I normally do about three new ones and then three older ones And then obviously we're gonna merge in the middle because I've got a massive list of games to play So hopefully you guys enjoy this video anyway If you do don't forget to smash that like button for me uh, if you do like it Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already uh, both the likes and subscribes really do help the channel out massively So if you could show your support man, I would really really appreciate it uh, if you guys would like to get in touch with me and have a chat in the description down below is all my contact details, so you can check all that out. Uh, if you guys would like to smash that notification bell as well, then you guys will get notified when we upload a video or when we live stream as well. Uh, I just want to say straight off the bat, I'm absolutely digging this music at the moment, so it's really, really cool. Um, so yeah, so without further ado, let's uh, hit new game. Tutorial, campaign, or sandbox? Uh, I've never played them before, so I sort of want to go tutorial, but I think I'm just going to go campaign. I think, I don't know, now let's do tutorial, sorry, I, I know you guys have probably seen this game a thousand times, but I've never played it before, so yeah, maybe tutorial may be the best. Um, obviously, I, I've played a lot of City Builder games, so I'm hoping it's just a similar sort of... Um... Welcome to Tropico, Presidente. I am your loyal advisor and number one fan, Penultimo. And okay. I am here to remind you of the joys of dictatorship. Okay. The numbers above the minimap represent your current treasury, population, and support. Since Tropico is currently just uh, is currently just a colony of the Crown, the number next to the calendar represents the remaining years and months of your mandate as its governor. Close this message by clicking, click, 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 click by click, click, clicking on the OK button to continue. So what we got? So cash. What's he say? Treasuries. Yeah. So cash, population, and support. Okay. The camera offers a bird's eye view of your island and starting town. True. Move the mouse cursor on the edge of the screen to pan in any direction. Use the mouse wheel or page up, page down key to zoom in and out. Hold the middle mouse button or the alt key to rotate or tilt the camera. Uh, the camera controls will be present on screen for the duration of this tutorial. Try them now. Objective from to have to have to the CV. Okay, accept. Oh, I zoomed in a little bit fast. Graphics are a bit jank. Okay, obviously I know it's 2015 though, so. various goals that allowed you to progress within the mission. Mm -hmm. Some tasks are given to you. Others are started from marker icons which appear in your city. Okay. You can see all active tasks at the right side of your screen. The in-view task markers look like this. Bam. Complete all tutorial... Oh, okay. Complete all tutorial tasks. Oh. Tasks are various goals that allowed you to progress within the mission. Yeah, I know. Oh. All presidentes have special executive powers, such as the ability to control time itself. Mm -hmm. Indeed, being the most awesome person in the world, you are able to accelerate time at your whim. Thank you, sir. Press the forward button to do so. Objective, increase the game speed to fast. Okay. Good job. Thank you. Fast speed is very useful when you have to wait for things like building construction or the export of produced goods. True. You are also able to slow down and even stop time when things get too frantic. No tasks will progress whilst time is paused, but you can still issue orders. Facts. Time for an official inspection, Presidente. Okay. Uh, you can select any building by left clicking on it. This will open the building info panel and show you all important information about it. Objective. Select any building. Make sure that the game is not paused. Uh, you can choose the building info panel by clicking on a clear ground in the view. Wait, what? You can close. Oh, you can close the building info panel by clicking on anywhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bam. 
Oh, what is this? Palace. Nice, we've got a budget. Uh, we've got manager, none. Okay. Don't know what these are. Okay. I would like to press uh, Q and E to rotate the camera. Instead of doing that, I'd like to do Q and E. Uh, hang on a minute, is that a thing? Uh, no. Wait, what? Um, we're, we're on, we're on 75, bro. Colorblind mode? Nope. Rendering? Oh, that's why, hang on a sec. That's why everything's so bad. Yeah, I want, I want detail level on high. Why is it so low? Uh, what's happened here? There we go. That's why everything looks so rubbish. Details are on low. I can't seem to move with WASD. Maybe we don't have to move. I know it's tutorial, but I'm just trying things out. Ah, so that looks way better. My my apologies, guys. That looks horrible. Um, I didn't see any of that. Ah, oh, hotkeys. Here we go. Uh, Panel. What do you mean pa- Oh no, don't say it's one of them. Is it one of them where it's like arrow keys? Oh no, don't be arrow keys. It's really jank- <laughs> Really janky. Hang on a sec, don't be arrow keys bro. Please, please don't be arrow keys. Can we change that? Uh, up, down, left, right. Uh, ooh, I'm jamming out to this music man. Oh, so these are all buildings. Uh, hang on a minute. Research dynasty, trade, constitution. Oh, they're also all buildings. Just scroll. Okay, it looks like I can't really change. There we go. WASD for that. I can't change the panning. Tilt or rotate. Can't really change it. Weird anyway. Yeah, that, that graphics look a lot better. Right, sorry about that. Right, where were we? What were we doing now, Brazadente? No, no. You said click on a building. I'm doing that, though. Yeah, info panel. A boat here. A ruler that doesn't pay attention to his subjects may end up on the wrong side of a coup d'etat. Okay. Let's select one of the little tropicans. Okay. Point at any of your citizens and left click uh, to select them. You may have to zoom in to do so. Selecting the citizen opens his info panel, showing all information that we have on him, including his approval for your regime. Select a citizen, make sure that the game is not paused. Okay. Uh, let's find one. Find a little fella. Why are they going really fast? Oh, there we go. Freighter exporting tropical goods worth. Ooh. Oh, okay, it's a lot. Age 15, birthplace. Illiterate, lives in the shack. She's a soldier. 15 year old soldier, really? Work, workplace is the palace. She's broke. Approval is 30. Oh, we can kill her. Well, approval's only 30. What is that out of? Why is that really loud? That is really loud in my ears, man. What is that? Hold on a sec. That's that's too loud, man. Sound effects. To be fair, voice is not too bad. Sound effects is a little loud. Yeah, still a bit too loud, bro. <laughs> what are sound effects so loud for? Chill with the sound effects, bro. Might even turn that down a little sign. Still a bit loud, but okay. Oh, I, I did it. I did it. Is it someone specific or... A little look around maybe. Is it someone specific or... Elections? What elections? Who are you? Is that me? Hola. Hi, hi, hi. 
Hola, como is that? Um, am I doing something wrong here? Game's not paused, is it? Oh, I don't like the mouse wheel being like that, man. What you doing to me, man? I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I did it. What's next? Give me something else. Please give me something else. I don't understand. Have I not done it? See, it's infrastructure. Wow, this is quite in depth, huh? Hey! <laughs> That's me! Okay. No, I don't want a customer. I just wanted to have a look. That's me, though, bro. What is this? No research points, okay. Uh, what is that? What not tell me, I've got this camera thing stuck. Uh, okay, trade. Agriculture, other, mining, logging, industry, luxury, okay, cool. Overlays. I'm going to do my own tutorial, because the tutorial's not very good. Whoa, what's all so, oh, could you tell me what to do then, please? I don't, I don't get it. I'm, do, I'm done, bro. I'm done. Tasks are various goals that allowed you to progress within. Yeah, but it said you can see all active tasks, tasks at the right given. side of your screen. The in view task markers look like that. Seat. Where, though? Oh, May. Over here? Paying attention to our infrastructure what? is very important. Looks like this iron mine has not been connected to a road. This means it will never be able to export its produced goods. Okay. Connect the mine to the road network. Okay. Uh, so we just go on here. Roads. Connect it like that. There we go. What's it doing? Stop. A road intersection is too near. What? What about? Good. Oh, that's right. Done. Is now connected, and the Teamsters will carry its production to the docks. Okay. It will be exported on the next ship that arrives there. Sweet. Export a hundred iron. Good. Germain is good. Now... Tasks. Good. Tasks. Good. Tasks. Good. Sorry. <laughs> uh. Okay, so how do we get construction office? Uh, how do we get Are you working? Speed up time. I don't know if it just automatically gets put there or not. I'm trying to look at like what what have I got in storage? Plantation cone. Do we do maybe you just have to wait? Oh, there you go. Iron output. That's what I'm trying to look for. I'm trying to look for what's here. Do you know what I mean? Do we just do we press play? Uh, mining and logging. Import. No, I want to export though. Export. 
No, I want to export... Why can I not choose what to export? Huh? What do we do then? Just wait? Loads of iron, I just can't seem to like ship it out. Trade. Uh, add a ship, maybe that. Remove ship. I don't know, man. Guess we just wait. Is there a marker we can click on? Oh yeah. Building a glorious future is your most important task as our president. Need to keep looking for these markers. Let me show you how to erect new buildings. A trade a trade route has no active ships. I don't care. Construct a cat. Construct a Catholic mission? Okay. Yeah, I don't care. What trade route's that then? I'll tell you, I don't even care, bro. Yeah, one of one ship. Shut up. Fucking rhubarb. Building a glorious future Construct a Catholic uh, mission, okay. Building. Uh, welfare and media, that's an okay. Catholic mission. Uh, pff, I don't know where, like. Oh, can I not zoom in when we're in this mode? Uh, that's a shame. Build one there, Let's have a look at the building process. I like to see. Wait a minute, can I change the. Yeah, can I change, like, the scroll speed? Plaz. It's a bit better. I'm gonna be scrolling in really quick. It's like really loud. Why is it still so loud? Sound effects. Okay, I don't want it all the way down. Like half, mate, like a quarter. That's a bit better. Why have to be so loud? Woo wee! President, thank you. you. Are the best leader anyone could wish for. I know, right? You in charge. All our dreams are fulfilled. You're very true. The next tutorial will teach you about economics, research, and stashing money in your Swiss bank account. Nice. Let's learn it. Let's go. Go on then. Hurry up. I got all day. Welcome Thank you. to the second tutorial. Okay. It will teach you how to research new technologies, create a stable and profitable economy, and how to issue edicts. Okay, complete your tutorial tasks. Great. Uh, let's to go. research new technologies, you must first build a library. Oh, okay, so you need libraries to do research technologies. Okay, so we'll go building hammer, uh, edu research and education library. Whoa, that's a big building, huh? Oh, I still kept my church. Oh, that's cool. It still kept my like, little church and stuff. We'll have a library next to the church. Let's speed up time. Yeah, we'll have a library next to the church. Because why not? That's me. Cristobal Reyes. Where's he going? He's going to church, bro. Going to sit on the church bench. Nice. We're building houses here now. Woo, we look like... Look at us. We're teeming with, we're teeming with life. Nice. Woo. 18%. Wait, what? Who needs to be taken out? Someone on these carts are moving really quick. Get him. We could just knock off anyone for 2,000. Why would you do that? Nice. Looking beautiful. You will need some educated workers to start conducting research in the library. Okay. Uh, invite three colleague. Uh, invite three college-educated workers in the library to start the research on planks. Okay. Invite foreign worker. Is it foreign workers? Is it? Okay. So what? Foreign workers are educated. How long does that take? I did it, bro. They got to come in on board. Ooh 
I love the music. Music is fantastic. Come on now. Waiting for foreign workers. We're on full speed. I'm quite enjoying it so far. Um, I know it's quite an old game, so it feels a little bit janky, but I'm sort of enjoying it. I'm having a good time, and I suppose that's that's all that matters. Hopefully you guys are as well, like that does matter as well. Oh, three foreign workers have arrived. Nice. Uh, yeah, she looks educated. They all look educated because they've all got glasses on, to be fair. Oh, no! Ah, <gasps> uh, I just fired. I just fired a guy. I'm sorry, sorry, bro. I didn't mean to fire you. I was going to left click on you. Left double click to select. Yeah, I just I wanted to see. Oh, you're from. You're from En Francais. Oh, oui, oui. Where are you from then? Oh, you're German? Okay. The last guy. <clears throat> I don't know where the last guy was from, but he. Yeah, he got, he got gone. I mean, we could finish it, but. <clears throat> I want it, alright? Oh, what's this? Alright, for the other guy to come back in. Actually, now it's not it. We'll, we'll carry on. We can send, expeditions out to explore our island and discover send an expedition to explore the island. Send an expedition to explore the island. Research planks. Oh, yeah, we didn't even do this. Let's research planks then. <coughs> oh, bless me. I sneezed my bloody head off them. Right, researching planks, sweet. I've got to do what? Send an expedition to research the island. What island? This island? What island would you be referring to? I have not got a clue what he's on about. Oh, send an expedition to explore the island. Okay, so you just click on the main menu. One citizen's arrived in Tropico. Yeah, that would probably be the... Oh, we have to... Do you mean this island, or you, what? What island do you want? Are you talking about? Is it anywhere? Oh, okay. So it's anywhere on our island. Um, what about there? What is that? Here he goes. Why are they gun people? Why are they soldiers? I didn't ask for soldiers. Where are you from, sir? What is that? Is that... That's not Colombia, is it? No, that's not Colombia. Hmm. Where are they going? Yeah, good luck trying to get up there. <laughs> I did it on top of the mountain, bro. It looked like ruins, that's all. Don't say they're going to go through the mine, are they? just discovered the oh. number of times you need to get hit by a plank to actually discover something. It is around seven, depending on the plank in question. We call this <laughs> the plank constant. I am sure it will become very important one day. Okay, lumber mill unlocked, sweet. Yeah, good luck trying to get around there, boys. I'm gonna have to go like all the way around. You'd have been better off going that way, to be honest with you. Uh, so what are we While doing? Waiting for the research to be completed. Let us set up the production of raw material. Okay. Let's order a logging camp from the natural resources category in the build menu. Let's do it. I'm ready. Construct a logging camp. I'll accept it. Anyway, we did planks. Actually, no, nah, that's not. He might tell us to research something. I mean, we will need it. Um. Okay, resource logging camp. I'm guessing not enough trees in the area. Yeah, this is what I was thinking. It's got to be like somewhere green, in it? Like greenery. Too far from road network. Connect to a construction office. What? What do you mean construction office? What are you talking about? Not enough trees. Yeah, but can we not just build a road? Unless maybe we have to build a road out, road out first. Uh, just trying to think. Like green out here, isn't it? Let's cancel that a sec. Maybe we do a road first.
Don't bend round, son. No, that's it. Right, now we can... There we go. Right, so we needed to just be able to road it road out there first. Makes sense. Did you what did you do up there? Oh, so the map's sort of like hazy until you discover it. Ah, oh, I see. Good ah. job. Oh. The logging camp has been completed. Thank you. Buildings that are far away from the Teamsters office will take longer to be serviced. Okay, what does that mean, though? With the planks research completed and the logging camp ready, it is time to build our first factory, a lumber mill. Okay. We'll process logs from the logging camp into the more expensive planks resource. Right. But don't forget that you have to connect the new lumber mill to the road network. Uh, totally makes sense, bro. Uh, yeah, so you need to do a logging camp, then a lumber mill for the planks. Okay, that's understandable. Industry, a lumber mill. Just put a lumber mill anywhere though, can't we? We could put a lumber mill in town, but I think I might want to put it next to here. Put it next to a logging camp. And we have good. Ancient ruins. You can you can construct the ancient ruins luxury entertainment building at this location. Oh, thank you. Can we send out another exploring? That was quite fun. Can we explore over there? Get all that up, bro. Um, okay, so we're waiting for this. Five of twelve, really. Okay. One citizen's arrived in Tropico. Uh, I don't want any more people. Thank you. Our people are good. Oh, we got some. We got some little icons here now. I'm waiting for this though. Yeah. So it seems like as they go out, you're able to see more land. Okay. You can sort of see underneath it anyway, though. Unless it doesn't really show anything. I don't know. Okay, I get it, I get it. Right, so that's that built. Okay. Right, now what? Let's go over here. All buildings have allocated budgets. These encompass the money spent on them each month. Okay. Uh, maximize, maximize the budget in the Teamster's office. Maximise the budget, as in, what do you mean? Uh, move the slider to set the budget. Like that. Just full. What's this? Get off. Alright, I've done that. Let us build a production building, Presidente. Everybody likes animals. Let us build a ranch. It can be useful both for feeding our people and producing resources for export. Fair enough. Your resources are automatically exported at the start a trade price. route to export Back. planks to the USA. Trade. Okay. Edicts are special laws. Issue building issue. permit edicts. Okay. That's fine. We, we can do one at a time. It's not a not, not, not the problem. Uh, so ranch. Let's build a ranch first. Building raw ranch. Uh, do we possibly go over here? Um, I'm just seeing like where it says goats, llamas, and pigs. Is it depending on where you put it? Does it count as? Okay, if I was to put it here, thinking of obviously putting it next to the farm. Next to the mine, maybe. <laughs> I think that house has got to go. Nah, let's put it up here. Let's rotate it around this way. Put it there. Uh, trade planks with the USA. Okay. What's this? Ah, oh, that's a building permit. Okay, so that's the building permit one. Uh, active trade routes. Okay, so industry goods. 
planks to the US. So that, and then just add ship. You have no available ships. Oh, I get it. So, because we had one of one ship and we added it to that, now we have no remaining ships. Okay, CC. All right, then a building permit one. Let's crack on with that then. Nobody works as hard as you, Presidente. You toil day and night for us, and I say it is high time you do something for yourself. Approve this edict, and you will get, get something in your Swiss bank account for every building constructed on the island. Increases the cost effect. Building permit. Increases the cost of all buildings by 20% of their base price. Half of this increase is added to the Swiss account when a construction is finished. Oh, nice. Let us build something. Like a few cheap country houses to see how this corruption thing works. Okay. Earn 500 Swiss bank account. What is that? Dollar dollar? <laughs> Earn 500 dollar dollar Swiss bank account from constructions. Uh, okay. Building, residential, country house. Do 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 Okay. Okay, let's go here, maybe? I don't like the rotation. I want it to just be Q&E. There we go. Do four there. Road up there. Bam. Be four. See if four might work. The managers are either your dynasty members or exceptional citizens whose skills can improve a building's performance. Okay, assign a manager to the lumber mill. <coughs> Easy. Um, does anyone? Okay. <clears throat> They've all got one star, so... Higher. I did it! We've just got to do that Swiss bank account one now. Probably one more house might do it, or two. It looks like two did three, so yeah, so we're going to need four. So that was perfect. Okay, oh. You are like a good father to the entire tropical nation. Mm -hmm. Some may say that you are just too good. <laughs> well, I don't like to toot my own horn, but if you know what I mean. Is there something about the final tutorial? I didn't quite Welcome read. To the but... third tutorial. Okay. It will teach you how to advance to the next era. Create a constitution, keep your people happy, and deal with internal factions and foreign powers. Okay. Tropico is currently in the colonial era. We are subject to the whims of the crown, and you will be removed from office when your mandate, indicated above the minimap, expires. So four years. Most advanced buildings are unavailable during the colonial area. The economy depends almost entirely on production of raw resources. Special tasks from the crown grant extended mandate, population, and money as rewards. Okay. Your remaining mandate is displayed next to the that symbol. So four years. Okay. Two political factors are active in Tropico during the colonial era. The royalists and the revolutionaries. Other factions such as the militarists, the religious, the communists and the capitalists become prominent in later eras. I like that. I do like the fact that you actually progress through eras. That's actually quite cool. For a game of 2015, that's pretty deep. I like that. Check out the politics page in the Al uh, Almanac. To see the factions active in this era. Okay. Politics. Uh, nobody. <laughs> now you got royalists, revolutionaries, the crown. Oh, they're hated. Okay. Popular support. Because they're hated. Good standing, the revolutionaries. Natural, neutral, 50% for the crown. Okay. As you saw in the almanac. The progressive revolutionaries are on your side 
While the royalists oppose you. Ah, that's Jackson what the red was. The idea of an independent tropical. Ah, okay. Build two guard towers. <laughs> now, if that's me twice. Where's all my stuff gone? Ah, oh, come on, now. You changed my you changed my thing around, bro. Right, I, yeah, I get. Can we move that now? Uh, guard towers, okay. Military guard towers. Hmm. Do they have? Oh, they don't even have to be connected to like the road. Uh, I was gonna put one there and I'll put one there. Uh, speed up time. Do 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 do. I, I really wish Q and E were to rotate instead of the mouse wheel like this. Because when I go up with my mouse, it goes up like that, and then down is down. I guess that sort of makes sense. Never mind. <laughs> Scrap that. Never mind. Oh, we only got to build them. Good job. Thank you. By meeting the revolutionaries' demands, we will attract more people to their cause. Okay. Support for independence will grow, and Tropico will finally be able to progress beyond the colonial era. Let us see how popular support will grow. Wait, wait a while until the popular support grows to fifty-one. So we're currently at twenty. Oh. Okay, let's grab that, went 42. Do we do we just wait? Do we build do we build more oh no, 47. I was gonna say, do we have to build more towers or do we literally just wait this out? I'm on full speed, so Obviously I didn't realise this tutorial was so if beefy. If Tropical stays in the colonial era too long, your mandate will end, and a new governor will take your place. Time to declare independence and proclaim Tropico a free country. Okay, advance to the World Wars era. Uh, how do I do that? Presidente. Oh, I'm getting ahead of myself. <laughs> Governor, the island is ripe for revolution. Uh, well, okay. Proclaim His independence. His Majesty is most amused by your declaration of independence. I'm gonna buy our freedom then. Advanced industry becomes available. Rebels may appear to oppose your regime. Oh, oh, wait, lonely what? souls out there. This is Lulu, your radio host at the Jolly Roger Bar and Radio. What? Stay tuned for the best Tropico can offer. Or even better, come and join me for a drink on the beach. No, I'm good. Each era features several foreign powers. During the World Wars era, there are the Axis and the Allies. Okay, construct an embassy. Free Tropico is ready for its very own constitution, President. Draft the constitution. Okay, constitution. Oh, we have to choose one. Voting rights affects fewer voters based on. Okay, religion and state, armed forces, no education for soldiers. Voting rights, maybe? I don't know, whatever. Voting rights. Male citizens vote, wealthy citizens vote, all citizens vote, yes. Uh, religion and state. Atheists. Research is faster by 10%. Less religious citizens appear in Tropico. Increased liberty, happiness. Religious buildings lower crime in their vicinity. Uh, 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 I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Just middle one. Armed forces. High school soldiers, high effectiveness. No education for soldiers. High school soldiers, additional military squads raised in battles. Professional army, yeah, let's go for that. There you go. I did it. Uh, we're going to do an embassy as well, okay. We've got building. Embassy, we'll put it. There's a front door. Put it there. Okay, get that built. Why are we down 36%? Did they not like my, um. They not like my things? They not like how I do things? Special price today. Ooh. Wins a free drink. 
No. Anyone who has even the slightest idea what's in it will also get a drink because he's definitely not drunk enough. Finally, okay. the grand prize for the night and any other night. All cute guys get a free date with me. Oh, she sounds a bit easy. Okay, why does it stop? Keep going. I love the way that it's even got like a crane and stuff. That's really cool. I like that. Our embassy is ready. Time to invite a foreign power to our island. Invite either the Axis or the Allies in your embassy. Uh, allies. You have invited the Allies onto the island. This will strengthen our relationship with them, but worsen our standing with their enemies, the Axis. Be okay. advised. Poor relations may result in retaliation against Tropico. Okay, that's not a problem. Receive foreign aid. Invi invite a foreign power. Elections are coming, Presidente. No dictator likes them, but they are usually the better alternative to uprisings and military coups. Win the elections. The elections are coming, Presidente. As our constitution dictates, we have scheduled mandatory elections for 12 months from now. Okay. That's me. Why has he got 58%? Elections are coming, President. Uh, receive... You have invited the allies onto the island. Receive foreign aid. How do I do that? Um... The allies are temporarily postponed their bickering in favour of surviving the Great Wars. Tropico Tropico is becoming the tropical paradise it is supposed to be. More and more people are abandoning the hustle and bustle of city life to settle in shacks and live as one with nature. Right on, people. The beach is big enough for everyone, and my bar works 24-7. As election day draws near, it may be a good idea to check to see how happy your people are. This and other helpful information can be found in the almanac. Okay, check out the happiness page of the almanac, okay? Uh, is happiness the higher the better, I guess? I don't know. Overall happiness 27. Healthcare. Uh. Entertainment and healthcare? Low happiness values indicate that the Tropicans yeah. are not happy with certain aspects of their life on the island, such as the lack of entertainment. Mm -hmm. Let us build a tavern to address this. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm up for that. Let me slow down time a little bit. Uh, let's do that. Entertainment. Tavern. Boom. Can we fit it right in there? Next to the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's bang that there. Can also do a restaurant as well. That might make people a little bit happy, no? Oh, the roads have even changed. I've noticed they're not like dirt roads anymore. You notice that? It's a little restaurant day. Actually, can we put it? Okay, people want happiness. I'll give you happiness. Uh, what else was it? Happiness and no. It was entertainment, healthcare as well. Deaths from poor healthcare. Uh, okay. Which one's health? Tourism, welfare, maybe welfare? Clinic? Provides healthcare to citizens. Yeah, let's do that as well then. Um, put it on the back of the tavern just in case people get a bit sick. We're winning this election, I'm telling you. Let me direct your attention to another important edict. The Sovereign Debt. Okay, repay the Sovereign Debt. Repay the debt by buying back the bonds. Okay, done. Representative percentage of the voters that support you. If you are concerned about the election rules, you can use certain edicts such as tax cut to influence the voters. 
so bad that I now declare us finally free of the harmful influence of modern medicine. No more compulsory inoculations. No more tracking chips in our dental you fittings. Go. No more physician's oath keeping the cute doctors from dating you. Who cares about healthcare anyway? Give okay, people a tax cut. What do you want? What's this? That's people, isn't it? Okay, well, I'm, I'm building stuff. Let's speed up time. Let's get this already up and built. I've got a tavern, I've got a restaurant, I've got healthcare popping. The allies send you money. Nice! People working there, yeah? My, why is it going down? Uh, what's going on? Hey, I've got a restaurant popping. Forty three, okay. I did a tax cut, what more do you want me to do? Um, Let me explain how service buildings such as our tavern work. Okay. The tavern provides people living in the vicinity with entertainment, thus increasing their happiness. Yeah, but it's not though. I don't get it. Uh. Healthcare is still really bad. Why do we need clinics? Just grow a pair, people. I once had a whole sea urchin stuck in my foot. But did I go to clinic? No. Then, when an overfriendly llama attacked me while I was removing the urchin and I had to fight it off, did I go to clinic like a crybaby? No. And when I finally had to run across the entire island after the llama came back with his friends in stilettos? No, I just went to my secret rum stash and drank it all. Nice. Like Tropicans should, instead of going to a clinic like a bunch of pansies. Alright, calm down. Uh, oh, maybe we can do that actually. Maybe budget for it. Just, just maybe rich. We have an opportunity to influence the outcome of coming elections. Strictly speaking, this is not considered exactly legal, but I guarantee that no one will find out. Okay. Oh, I'll just press we can win without cheating, though. And I really didn't mean to do that. Can I get off that a minute? I'm trying to... Get foreign the workers in there. has happened, Presidente. We have lost the elections. Okay. A devilish combination of the global economy, the Illuminati, bad weather, and just plain rotten luck made you lose. Uh, please leave your beard and your hat on your desk on your way out. Okay. <laughs> so we didn't end up winning it. Okay, fair enough. I think maybe you were meant to lose that because obviously I had I had uh, clinics up and I had a restaurant up, I had a tavern up and everything. And it still it wasn't enough, so. But that's the tutorial done anyway, and that's I've, I've run out of time as well, so that is going to do it for this episode. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, smash that like button and subscribe, man. Let me know you want to see more. And uh, yeah, if you want to get in touch with me, in the description down below is all my contact details, so you can go and check all that out. Uh, if you guys would like to smash that notification bell as well, then you guys will get notified when we upload a video or when we live stream as well. It's a very handy little tool indeed. And uh, yeah, until the next time, guys, have a good one. Stay safe out there. Peace out.